those six targets. Our contract is to kill them all. And the client is the general they served under. He wants them dead to keep them from talking. Check your VI and your iDroid for more information. for a fistful of diamonds, huh? And what happens after that? They can't go home. They've only got two options. Heaven or hell. No, there's another.
There's some high ground downriver. I'll have the chopper set down there. Lead the kids to safety. Listen, the kids don't get hurt. No matter what, you bring him back alive. Exit the cave and turn left, then pass through the swamp and follow the river downstream. What you thinking, boss? I'm thinking that he's tougher than he looks. A little training, he'll make himself useful. Never like kids. Especially ones with guns. <coughs> See, kids are natural. No. He's no natural. Far from it. You probably noticed on the way in we've expanded housing. They'll have their own quarters, separate from ours. Won't be counted as staff. So what, we're running a daycare now? To learn how to read and write. Do basic jobs. A chance at a real life. Just not from behind a gun. Being behind a gun's what we do, boss. There's no room for angels in our heaven.
was separated from the others and taken away to Ngumba Industrial Zone. The locals call this place Nzoya Badiabulu, the Devil's House. Boss, find Shivani and extract him safely. You can check the target's location on your iDroid.
Shivani, the boy sent me. And you must sign it, or ban it out. No boy break here, bun.
working behind the scenes. Even that man on fire at his beck and call. But what the hell was going on at the devil's house? Earphones embedded in people's throats, tapes playing voices. And those lumps on their chests. They looked like the ones on the bodies of the oil field. The man on fire burned everything to the ground. But we were recording audio the whole time you were there. We'll conduct a thorough analysis of it.